I just got out of the shower and I'm gonna be doing my skincare. I'm gonna be using these products that were sent by Alive Lab and I also wanted to thank Alive Lab for sponsoring this video. Alive Lab is a Korean skincare brand. Their packaging is so cute as you can see. And before I showered, I used this cleansing oil. It's a lemon basil cleansing oil. It's basically like a makeup remover. It's really nice and gentle on my skin and it just takes my makeup off really well. So first I'm gonna go in with this toner and it's called the true love story of toner. These products contain rose oil which makes it smell really good and also very moisturizing. It smells so good. Also love how it has a little pink tint. Now I'm gonna go in with this moisturizer and it's called the true story of emulsion. It protects and softens your skin and it's very easily absorbed so it feels very light on my skin which I like. Now I'm gonna go in with their True Love Story Cream. This cream feels so thick and rich on my skin, so it moisturizes it really well. Lastly, one of the coolest products from Alive Lab is this, and it's the Centella Dressing Powder. So basically, you can put this powder on zits, acne, or any like skin troubles that you have. As you can see, I have a lot of zits on my forehead and around my mouth so this is so good for that you can use this powder just by itself or you can also mix it with any other skincare product that you like for example i can mix it in with this cream for now i'm just gonna put it by itself that is the end of my skincare routine and if you guys are interested in any of the pro <coughs> So that is the end of my skincare routine and if you guys are interested in any of the products that I used, I'll have them all linked down below and definitely make sure to check out Alive Lab because all of their products are worth trying and are really nice. I'm currently getting ready right now to take some Instagram pictures. I have to take some pictures for a brand. I know it's a bit late, it's already 6.22 p.m. but I think I'm just gonna go to like a random staircase or something outside and take some pictures. My reading week is basically over and I have like midterms starting in like two days. I've been loving this Dior lip glow oil. It's such a nice lip gloss. I've noticed a lot of people on TikTok use it. My hair is still a bit wet because I didn't get to dry it. I kind of want to do something different with it today for my Instagram pictures, but we'll see. So I just finished getting ready and I decided to put my hair in pigtails and then this is my fit for the picture Gives off very preppy schoolgirl vibes and I also wore some leg warmers with these like Mary Jane shoes I'm gonna freeze taking these pictures because it's so cold outside My mom gave me this like blanket thing to wrap around because it's so cold right now I'm at the picture location now and I just came to like some random bus station. It's literally empty. There's no one My mom's gonna be taking pictures <laughs> I actually love this place like the lighting is so nice and I really like the background It's like what I like for my Instagram pictures like white and cream I'm literally freezing right now. I'm like shivering, but I think I got the pictures So I just got home from taking the pictures But I'm gonna eat some dinner We got some takeout chicken I'm still freezing from taking the pictures I can't stand eating chicken with like bare hands for some reason I'm literally wearing a glove So I just got ready because I'm gonna be going out to get my nails done finally I've had these nails for like over a month now and I'm also gonna get a haircut today I don't know why but I just kind of want something different with my hair I'm not gonna be cutting it short but I'm definitely gonna get like layers and try like style it because lately I just feel like my hair looks so like boring and flat These are the nails that I got this time. I went for something a bit different, but I think this is so cute. It's like perfect for March. I also got rid of my fake nails and these are my actual nails for the first time in forever. So it feels so good to have like shorter nails.
so weird right now because the sun is like setting but i got a little haircut you can't really tell right now my hair just feels so much more clean So I just got home. I wanted to show my hair in better lighting. It doesn't look that different because I didn't really do too much to it. I always felt like my hair looked so flat and like ugly when it wasn't styled. So I think getting layers and curtain bangs finally makes it look a bit more like alive. And then as I showed earlier, I also got my nails done. So cute. I also got this BTS coffee and I'm really thirsty. So I'm gonna try some. Oh my god, it's so bitter. It's not sweet at all. Yeah, I don't even want another sip. I'm not even a coffee person myself. I don't know why I got this, but I just wanted to try it on camera. I'm still so thirsty right now, so I'm gonna try this peach drink thing. Mmm. Oh my god, I got so scared because I was looking at this upside down and I thought it said the expiry date was March 1st and today is exactly march 1st this is actually really good there's like chewy little fruit pieces like peach i should get like a thumbnail i never have like thumb worthy thumb worthy i never have like thumbnail worthy pictures we can finally eat in our kitchen now because it's all done I love how my hair looks today. You guys, I'm finally in my new kitchen. It looks so good on camera. But I'm gonna make some product topoki right now. It's been a while since I came back home from school, but I've been craving this. So. I haven't been able to use my kitchen for like over a month. We also got a new fridge and this one is so cool. We have this like screen and it basically works like an ipad you can use like spotify and the internet but it's so cool as you can see like all my playlists are here and then literally search myself on youtube on the fridge i also love how this fridge like there's a separate thing you can open for just water and then this opens the whole fridge
I'm not even breathing. No, this is literally like solid. <laughs> I'm shaking, I'm shaking. By the way, I forgot to show you guys my like new kitchen and renovations. So this is kind of like our front door area and my mom like added this new thing. Looks very modern and nice. And then the final reveal of our kitchen. It had such a glow up. I'm sure you guys remember how my old kitchen looked from all my like what I eat in a week videos and just my vlogs in general. It was just not that cute of a kitchen. This is literally my mom's dream kitchen. So we have it all like white themed and very modern so now that our kitchen is done i wanted to just let you guys know that i'm probably going to be filming a cooking with my mom video really soon i know this video has been requested for so long but i wanted your guys's input on what to make in the video because i don't really have a clear idea on what to make with my mom or what would be like entertaining so let me know in the comment section down below on what you guys want me and my mom to cook in the video for example like topoki. so yeah i'm really excited for that video also it hasn't been too long since i got home from a really long day today I at school and then after that me and my friends went to this claw machine place called claw and kitty which is like really popular on tiktok so it was my second time going because the first time i went i didn't really get footage but i'll like insert a clip here of last time But basically at the place they have like a bunch of different claw machines and each claw machine equals like a different number of points and at the end with all the points that you gathered you can trade in the claw machine plushies for other stuff so i just want to show a quick little haul from everything that i won so the first time that i won i think i won like six points so i was able to trade it for two different things first i traded it for this real akuma plushie this is literally the cutest thing ever i love real akuma so and then i also won this keychain it's so cute i decided to add it to my tote bag like this i think it looks so cute with the tote bag and then today I won like 8 points so I was able to get a bit more stuff So I got these two and this is literally the cutest thing that I've ever seen They are these My Melody and Kurumi plushies And this one's a watermelon and then a strawberry And then the third prize I gave to my friend You can stick it like that I feel like I'm just gonna leave the real Akuma here so this basically concludes the video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you in my next one. 